a man sells chocolates in boxes either full boxes or half box of chocolates can be brought bought from him a customer comes and buys half the number of box the seller has plus half a box okay a second customer comes and buys half a box after this the seller is left with no chocolate box how many chocolate boxes did the seller have before the first customer came initially this question is just a question on attention to detail right you read whatever is given correctly and understand it correctly you will get the answer in less than 5 to 10 seconds yes when you look at the options see i am taking option 2 assume that the the uh, man has two chocolate boxes with him so what can i do i can either buy a full box from him or half of a chocolate box right now initially i had two so the first customer is coming what is the first customer doing he buys half the number of chocolate boxes so half the number of chocolate boxes means how many chocolate boxes buying he is buying one chocolate box half of two is one plus another half chocolate box he is buying so plus half so how many chocolate boxes have we bought he has bought one one by two now how much is remaining with the person what is remaining with the person is only half right totally he had two chocolate boxes out of that 1.5 he has sold so he has remaining only half now a second customer comes and buys half a box a second customer comes and buys this box after this the seller is left with no chocolate box how many chocolate boxes did the seller have obviously two now lot of you gave me the answer as three so let us assume three was the case okay so if three was the case what would have happened the first customer comes and buys ha uh, half of what the number of boxes the seller had correct so the first customer is buying 1.5 boxes plus another half box he is buying so i can say he is buying two boxes so how many boxes is left with the seller now he is left with one box now the next customer is coming and he is buying half a box so how much is now left with the seller see he had one box out of which half box is bought by the second customer so again he has half a box left with him which cannot come so the correct answer here will be option 1 it is cannot be 3 okay it cannot be 3 it has to be two boxes it cannot be three boxes similarly one boxes will also not come because if you use only one box by giving it to the first customer itself the seller will not have any box with him okay i'll explain how it is two once again assume that the seller has two boxes with him a customer comes and buys half the number of boxes from the seller has plus half a box so half the number of boxes the seller has means out of two boxes two divided by two or half of two that is one box this first customer is purchasing plus half a box so totally the first customer is purchasing one and a half boxes now how much is remaining with the seller half a box is remaining with the seller now what are they saying a second customer is coming and buys half a box so the second customer is buying this half box with that now the seller has nothing left with him so that is what they are giving in the question once the uh, second customer comes and buys half a box the seller has no chocolate boxes left with him how many chocolate boxes did the seller have initially before the first customer came answer is option 1 that is 2 okay very easy just check with the options now if you are uh, going with equation totally there are n boxes okay now out of this n boxes what is happening the first customer Uh, if you have totally n boxes the first customer is buying n by 2 boxes plus 1 by 2 correct the second customer is buying half a box now what do we know see we know that this n by 2 plus half plus half this is equal to the total number of boxes the seller had because once these two people have bought the seller has no box left with him equate this if you solve this also you will get the value of n as 2 okay yes